show. What's up, everybody? And um, in today's video, um, we are going to be reviewing uh, Venom: Let There Be Carnage. Um, I did see this movie um a few days ago, and um, there are going to be huge spoilers for those who haven't seen this video. So if you haven't seen the video, I suggest you click off this video, go see the movie, and then you can watch the movie. Unless you want the movie to be spoiled for you. Um, I kind of did that myself, actually. But yeah, there are going to be huge spoilers in this uh, video. So if you don't want spoilers for the movie, might as well just click off right now. So um, I really liked the first Venom movie. I thought it was pretty funny, and it was awesome. Um, so I got really excited when I first heard about this um, movie coming out. And um, I think that they did a really nice job with it. Um, it is only one hour and 30 minutes long, I think. Because, yeah, it's 90 minutes long. Um, and I think they did a really good job with the movie. Um, in the movie, you get right into the action with the first few minutes. Um, and yeah, they just did everything um, great, in my opinion. I think this movie was a masterpiece. Um, I feel like Woody Harrelson, um, I think I'm saying his name right, um, was a great choice for um, Cletus Cassidy. And yeah, they, he did the role so well, in my opinion. Um, you guys might have other opinions, but this is all coming from my opinion. Um, Carnage was awesome. Um, he looked incredible. And my favorite part of the movie, I think, was when um, the um, prison escape um, jailbreak thing um, scene when he's just like um killing all those um officers and stuff i think i feel like that was a really cool uh scene right there um yeah so i think that was my favorite scene um but yeah like carnage was just awesome um it just looked carnage looked amazing um i i don't remember seeing in the movie carnage um like the black lines he had in the comic books i think um yeah, but, um, it was still, he still looked really cool. They did a nice job with him. Um, so, yeah, um, I think, um, zero out of five stars, um, I'm going to give Venom with the B Carnage's, um, action a four out of five. Yeah. Um, like, like I said at the beginning of the video, or, like, towards the beginning of the video, how, like, you know, the action, there's action throughout the whole entire movie, um, and, like, in the first few minutes, boom, already jumping right into the action, um, so, yeah, the, um, action, four out of ten for Venom, let there be kind, and, um, like, another thing I liked about Venom was how they were trying to keep it, like, you know, it's a pretty serious movie, but at the same time, you know, Venom, you know, fighting with Eddie Brock, they try to make it pretty funny too and i think they did a very nice job at that um one of the funny parts was when um venom took like um the body of someone else after it left eddie's and then it's just like smashing his bike i feel like that was pretty funny yeah so like venom's relationship with eddie in this new movie was really funny i really enjoyed that so, um, with that being said, um, comedy in this movie, um, I think I'm going to give that 0 out of 5 again. Um, I think I'm going to give it a 3.5 out of 5. And, guys, you might have different opinions. This is coming from my opinion. Um, I really enjoy this movie, um, in my opinion. And, um, at the end of the movie, you see, um, man, I forgot his name, um, <clears throat> um, I forgot his name. Um, the one officer, um, you guys should know who I'm talking about. Um, who was toxin in the comic books. At the end of the movie, his eyes were going blue. So, I think that some of Carnage's symbiote went inside of him. When, like, um, he was, like, I, I don't know how to explain it. Um, but yeah, I think he's gonna be toxin in the next movie. Um, for Venom, or, um, this is a huge spoiler alert, so, it, like, if you haven't clicked off the video yet, and you still haven't seen the movie, you really, like, want to click off the video right now, like, 
right now. Um, cause or maybe um, Venom three will also take place in Spider Man No Way Home. That might no, uh, maybe not because Venom three is probably gonna come out in like twenty twenty three or something. Um, uh, but could happen. Um, because at the end of the movie we see a very interesting um post credit scene. Spoiler alert! Venom's made to the MCU, baby. Let's go. Thank you so much for watching this video. Um, that is all for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if the comments are on, again, sorry, um, comments turn on and off randomly. I don't control it. Um, if they are on, let me know what you thought of the movie. Um, I thought it was very well. It was made very well. And I can't wait to buy it on, on Blu-ray. So, um, thanks for watching, and see you in the next one. Peace.